when we are creating our MOOCs, it is not sufficient to simply focus on information transmission and making accessible the various activities that one would do in a classroom. It is necessary to ensure that we follow learner centric principles. The LCM model helps instructors to create MOOCs which are learner centric in nature. The LCM model consists of learning dialogues which promote concept attainment through learner interaction, learning by doing which is a formative assessment activity, learning extension trajectories which advance learners learning along diverse paths, learning experience interactions which cultivate peer learning through focus discussions. In addition to these elements, it is important to keep in mind the orchestration that is the process by which the course team designs the interactions for the learners as well as assists and guides the learners through the MOOC. Now that you have seen the different elements in the LCM model, imagine a typical classroom scenario. Can you identify one or more of these LCM elements in this scenario? Pause the video and write down your answer. After you are done, resume. Some of you may have thought of lectures and demos. Some may have thought about activities, others may have thought about additional resources that are provided and some may have thought about discussions. Now let us see how these map to the LCM model. In going from the traditional model be it a classroom or a MOOC to the learner centric MOOC model, what we need to keep in mind is instead of simply creating lectures and demos and making them available. We now create learning dialogues or LEDs. Instead of simply making activities and homeworks available to students, we now create learning by doing activities or LBDs with customized feedback. Instead of simply making discussion forum platforms available to students, we now have learner experience interactions or LXIs. These are driven by focused questions and exploit the power of peer learning. Instead of simply making some resources available to learners, we now have learning extension trajectories or LXTs. These help diverse learners advance their learning along their own chosen paths. Instead of simply making the contents available to the learners, we now orchestrate the course through these LCM elements in order to provide a rich and connected experience to all the learners in the MOOC. Now that you have got a glimpse of what is the LCM model, many of you must be eager to get into the details. We will now take you through the journey of creating LEDs, LBDs, LXTs and LXIs, thereby designing a learner centric MOOC for your own course.